It's hard to imagine what it's like not to imagine. Think of some cherished memories or some visions of your future. You don't have any images, sounds, feelings associated with any of those memories. And there, there was a, what I call a sacred tree, all a curved by the wind, you know. I asked her to lay down naked on the tree and cover up with a blanket. And I start my ritual, the magic to, to heal her. So when you are coming in drag, you have to kind of figure out who you are. So I knew I wanted to be old school glamour. I wanted to be inspired by figure skating. And then I was trying to think of what is my name going to be? And I, I just couldn't figure out a name. And then I went to, OK, what inspires me? Kurt Browning? Skirt Browning. It was a bit of a no-brainer. The very first time I met him was the day before the wedding. I was just so scared of raising my eyes and looking at this person who's going to be apparently my future husband. And then when I did finally muster up the courage to look, I just felt this jolt of like fear and like this big voice in me screaming, no. This looked like someone who could be a friend of my father's. I, I personally thought of Israelis as the enemy. The first time I saw him, it was like this like, Everything inside my, my body raised, like the trauma, the resentment, the anger, the confusion. I just like I took a big, big breath and like let everything go and I said, let's try something new. You break all these barriers and you're like, you, you see the humanity that connects us. 